Hello and today I present to you the movie The Beverly Hillbillies 1962. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023 after 61 years. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us. Alright, let's get started. Number 1, Buddy Ebsen played Jed Clampett in the 1962 film. The man had little formal education and was completely naive about the world outside of his area, but had a lot of wisdom and common sense. His ancestry is revealed in the series 1 episode 25 that his family arrived in America before the Mayflower arrived. However, he later denied this to keep Mrs. Drysdale satisfied. Buddy Ebsen played Jed Clampett when he was 54 years old. Sadly, Ebsen died of respiratory failure at Torrance Memorial Medical Center in Torrance, California, on July 6, 2003, at the age of 95. Following his death, he was buried at Pacific Crest Cemetery in Redondo Beach. Number 2, Irene Ryan played the role of Daisy Mae Moses in the 1962 film. Known to all as Grandma, is Jed's mother-in-law so is often referred to as Grandma Clampett despite her last name, and despite her surname. Despite the fact that in the pilot episode Milburn Drysdale calls her Jed's mother. She is a descendant of the Moses clan, who learned of her feud when Moses drove Bodkins out of Napoleon, Tennessee. She has a rough personality and gets angry easily, but is often overpowered by Jed. Irene Ryan played Daisy Mae Moses when she was 60 years old. Sadly, Ryan died at St. John's, Santa Monica, California, on April 26, 1973, aged 70. The causes of death were given as glioblastoma and atherosclerosis. Number 3, Donna Douglas played Allie Mae in the 1962 film. The only child of Jed and Rose Ellen Clampett, is a beautiful upland beauty with the body of a florist and the soul of a tomboy. In a very early episode, Jed tells Ellie Mae that she is the image of her mother. Donna Douglas played Ellie Mae when she was 30 years old. Sadly, Douglas died at Baton Rouge General Hospital at the age of 82 on January 1, 2015 of pancreatic cancer. Her burial was in East Feliciana Parish. Bluff Creek Cemetery of Louisiana. Number 4, Max Beer Jr. played the role of Jethro Bodine in the 1962 film. Is the goofy son of Pearl Bodine, Jed's cousin, although he calls Jed Uncle Jed, and Ellie Mae calls Pearl Aunt Pearl, a custom. Generational traditions. Pearl's mother and Jed's father are siblings. He took the Clampets to their new home in California and stayed with them to continue his education. In the first series, he was in fifth grade, having spent three years in fourth grade and two years in first grade. He goes to Oxford and this gets confused with Oxford University. Max Beer Jr. played Jethro Bodine when he was 25 years old. And now he is 86 years old. Number 5, Raymond Bailey played Milburn Drysdale in the 1962 film. Mr. Drysdale was the Clampett's banker, confidant and neighbor. Hess obsessed with money and to keep the Clampett's $96 million in his commercial bank, Mr. Drysdale will do everything he can to fulfill their every wish. Raymond Bailey played Milburn Drysdale when he was 58 years old. Sadly, Raymond Bailey died of a heart attack on April 15, 1980, at the age of 75, in Irvine, California. His body was cremated and his ashes were scattered over the sea. He is survived by his wife, Gabby Aida George, and is the uncle of actor William Sylvester. And number 6, Nancy Culp played Jane Hathaway in the 1962 film. The person the Clampets called Miss Jane, was Drysdale's loyal, highly educated, and efficient secretary. Although she is reluctant to grant his wishes, she truly loves her family and tries to protect them from the greed of her boss. Nancy Culp played Jane Hathaway when she was 41 years old. Sadly, in 1991, 
The cancer metastasized and she died on February 3, 1991, aged 69, in Palm Desert, California. Her remains are interred at Westminster Presbyterian Cemetery in Mifflin Town, Pennsylvania. Thank you for watching the whole video. If you liked this video please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so we can produce more interesting videos. Thank you and see you again.